such a sorry state. It was such a shiny bike, just like yours. He looked just like a rock and roll star. He told me he had a rough childhood and I thought he was real sensitive. Yeah, he had a rough childhood, all right. Sister Frosty, this is the second motorcycle child that's been deposited here this month. Them people's like animals. Look, he ain't wearing nothing but a saddlebag. Christ, oh my. He's got more on than the little girl did when they dumped her here. She wasn't wearing nothing but a sterling silver tire chain. Ain't that right, Sister Knuckles? For Pete's sake, get the kid indoors. He's got road rash. You watch. He's going to be a discipline problem just like the girl. I swear to God. Amen. Where did he go? He said he was looking for someone. Then he followed a crow that passed him in the sky out of town. Get away from my bike. Is he looking for you? Yeah, he's looking for me. Our souls are handcuffed together. We both knew it from the get-go. Crow over there says he wants to ride you on the back of his tricycle. So you better get over there. Tell Crow I ride my own tricycle. Oh, you're gonna get it. He's gonna beat on you, Winter CEO. He's gonna stop breathing before he turns seven. Do what you want, Crow. You're gonna have to turn your back on me someday, and that's when I'll get you from behind. That's the plug. He gives you the spark plug. That was the only thing that he ever got from his mommy and daddy. Oh, let me see it. I'm close. This trail smells like a burning church and looks like the place where goofies go to die. Where's your powder room? Mm, you're gonna need a key. You gonna give it to me? It's in my front pocket. You're gonna have to get it yourself. <laughs> Dude, these panties have been laundered. We put each other through every possible initiation to prove we were made to drag each other to heaven or hell. We purified our love with bloody noses and cigarette burns. When the juvenile youth authorities separated us, they didn't think a love-hate teenage relationship like ours would mean nothing to us after a little while. But they were wrong. I'm on your trail, you dumb bastard. Where the hell are you? Thanks for letting me fix your bike, Mr. Crow, sir. Lost my virginity as per the instructions. At last, I was ready for the sex change. I joined an order of military nuns and poisoned half of them. <laughs> Aha, if only the Mahoney twins were alive to see this. Have you ever seen this man? It's no good. I'm losing contact. Satisfaction.
father's murder is avenged. Now, a discussion of financial and amorous considerations. Imbecile, I just heard the radio reports. You killed the wrong man. Ah, weasel. Did you decipher the Arab's cryptic last words? Never mind that. I just got another anonymous tip. What do you suggest? Murder. <laughs> another five minutes and I'll be packed and out of here. Hey, what gives? Easy, sister. I'm Inspector Payne. What do you want, Flatfoot? Questions answered. Is it right to go sightseeing while killers are loose? Patience, my dear. I feel we are about to come full circle. Okay, Z. Stand still while I plug you. Sorry, that's not my style. Mr. Z, what was that all about? I'm not sure, my dear. But I sense that all these activities are being controlled by invisible hands reaching out of the darkness. from the salons of Vidal Sassoon. Vidal Sassoon conditioning rinse. Stick figure theater. Good afternoon. Here we have a quiet little motel. Uh, let's go along to cabin number one. I'll show you something there. The bathroom. You should have seen the blood. The whole, the whole place was, well, it's, it's too horrible to describe. Dreadful. Well, the murderer, you see, crept in here. Very slowly, of course, the shower was on, there was no sound. And, uh... I saw the punch coming a mile off. When I came to, my guts were given a part of once over. That's when I saw her. Thumb, huh? But that's me all over. 